Good morning, I'm Tim V. And I'm Lara V. And you're watching War TV. On this week's episode, we get into the holiday spirit with a special trip to Fairfield's own Wonderland at Roseville. And later, we have highlights from November's Beard Contest. Stay tuned. My name's George Mulligan. This is my wife, Mary Ann. My name is Billy Frostick. My name is Gene Hollowell, and I am the owner of the house of property at 226 Roseville Terrace. We uh, have been involved with this because this is all part of my father-in-law's creation. I started this whole process uh, 50 plus years ago with my dad and I. We're a place in Fairfield, we're right down the street from Ward. Um, we have over 120,000 lights this year. We're here from 5 at night till 10. Friday and Saturday nights we're here 5 until 11. And Sunday nights is 5 until either a 9, 10 or depending upon how busy it is and Christmas Eve, the lights are on all night long. On November 9th, 19 students and faculty members began growing out their facial hair for the annual charity beard contest. It may seem like some macho contest to see who has a better beard, but there is a purpose. It's a, it's a fun thing that happens in Fitz House, and this is the second year of it, so I never thought I would win. Uh, it's hard to imagine that the the uber beard was perched on my, perched on my chin just uh, a few days ago. Mr. Drexel. Oh, look at the beard. There, there were almost as many students doing it, maybe more, uh, as, as teachers this year. So it's uh, just, a, a, I think it's a testament to how much maleness here uh, at, at Ward High School. Any participants in the contest, including judges, had to contribute $5 towards the charity of the winner's choice. $120 was raised for the American Cancer Society. Uh, you know, there were some really strong beards out there, um, some that were you know, much better than mine, but uh, you know, somebody has to win, so it might as well be me. Welcome back. You're watching War TV. Congratulations to Mr. Pollux and his victorious uber beard. <laughs> Also, donations are welcome at Wonderland at Roseville. All proceeds will go to the Shriners Children's Hospital. And after our question of the week, what is your favorite holiday song? What is your favorite holiday song? Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. All I want for Christmas is you. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Yeah, I got run over by a reindeer. Santa baby, hurry down the chimney tonight. <laughs> Put on your yarmulke, here comes Hanukkah. Jingle Bell Rock. The dreidel song, it's made out of clay. It's a chipmunk Christmas song. Mistletoe by Justin Bieber. Oh wow. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Walking in a winter wonderland. Frosty the Snowman. What's your favorite holiday Christmas song? Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Good one. Christmas and Hollis, run DMC! Well, unfortunately, that's all the time we've got. A reminder to students, the Trends Boutique is now open. The fashion students are selling everything from bags and scarves to jewelry and hair feathers. Also, today our school newspaper, The Ward Focus, will be debuting online. You can visit the website at the bottom of the screen to get the latest info on school activities, sports, and the student body. This weekend is forecasted to be mild and sunny, so enjoy the beautiful weather while you can. I'm Tim V. And I'm Lara V. And, and we're, we're out. out. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh.